Hello dears! Today I will show you 5 things for my car that I printed on a 3D printer Creality Ender 3. Let's start with the headrest hooks. It is necessary to make measurements. The diameter of the pin. Distance to the edge of the back. I'll try to print this hook. Artifacts can occur when you zoom in or out. They are easy to eliminate. Mesh fixes, extensive stitching. Everything's fine now. All models I will print ABS plastic. This form is not very successful for parts that will experience power loads. The hook immediately broke when I started fixing it on the headrest, scrapping a cord along the layers. I tried a different arrangement of the part, but the result is the same. I started looking for other hooks. Try this. Change the scale. First I adjusted the size of the hook to the diameter of the pin and then changed to the length. To change each axis separately you need to disable the check mark of the uniform scaling. The height in this model is better not to change, otherwise the hook will not fit into the hole. Attention! Zooming in and out may result in slicing errors. For example, in this case I was unable to remove this defect and just took another similar model. It was completely fine. Usually I use zigzag as a template for the cover and bottom, but in this case the slicer made a mistake and voids were formed, so I switched to the line. It's gotten a lot better this way. I also printed a hook like this. And a few of those. Now we will test them all. These are different thicknesses, 6, 12 and 24 layers. They've been heft to the acetone bath, so they shine. With the help of weight see what weight they can withstand. more than 23 kilograms and does not break. I think it's enough for everyday use. These hooks should be in every car. It's convenient. Next, universal phone holder that attached to the car's ventilation grill. The product before processing. After acetone vapors. Assemble the holder. Testing. Thank you. 
super. I like that. Next. Broke the retainer of the hood holder. It is necessary to measure the diameter and compare with the selected model. I had to squeeze the spacers a little and everything fell into place. Very good. There was still such a problem. The mat slips. The hook that should hold it does not help. Still the carpet crawls away and you have to fix it every time. Came to the rescue here is a model holder. First you need to make measurement of the carpet and hook. The minimum thickness of the carpet 7 mm, with the pile 10 mm. The hook you need to make two measurements. The height of the imaginary triangle is 10 mm, the height to the band is also about 10. Means the inside diameter of the retainer should be about 10.5 mm. If you make more, then the hook will pop up from the catch. Open the model in the slicer and change the scale. Matte to 7 mm and it's only 4, so you need to stretch the model along the axis of the Y. Also do for the second model. Now you need to change the inside diameter. You need to change the dimensions only in the original position and only then rotate the model. These are the good details. By the way, connect to parts of the retainer is necessary so, the woman from below, the man on top. Install and snap. It was great. Very good, problem solved. Go further, propeller for the dashboard. Just cool stuff. The nose part was printed on the side for greater reliability, but it was very difficult to remove support. Details processed in an acetone bath. It's great. To put the propeller and improve its rotation had to work a little file. Very easy to install. Looks cool. Perhaps this is all. I hope this video was useful for you. Links to all the models can be found in the description of the video. Printed for you 3D printer Creality Ender 3. I'll leave a link to it too. Rate, subscribe, press the bell not to miss new videos and write in the comments what do you would like to see in the next videos. Good luck everyone! Bye!